What is community? I like to look at the word of it. It's a combination of two words, commune and unity. So to commune is to be together in some, some intimate way of connection, to commune. Often we think of that as our spiritual connection. We're communing with the Spirit of God by whatever name. But we have this connection between us also that we commune together. We, we be together. And when there's this feeling of unification, this feeling of being united, then we are community. We're being together, united in one thing. So when two or more are gathered, this is community. Well, what is beloved? I once again, look at the word. Be love. Be loved. Beloved. So it's the exchange of love, the willingness to give and receive love, I believe creates the experience of being beloved. And I've been thinking also about this word co-creation that's come up, and it's led me into seeing it within multiple dimensions. Shocker. <laughs> Three dimensions to be specific. I think about me as a being, you as a being. Like we're all beings and I have this sense of self, of, of who I am. And I also know that there is something greater. There is some spiritual presence. There is a higher self. There is a God self. There is something that I have the opportunity to come into oneness and create with. Co-creation is just creating with. And there's a big difference when between me as a personality of Gary, just out creating and doing things in the world, <clears throat> and being surrendered unto that higher divine presence and creating with God in my life. That's a, that's a big thing. So the second dimension, that's just one. The second dimension that I see is everything that's going on inside of this being that I know as me. All these parts of myself. I've got this sense of self. And if who I am is creating with the higher divine forces of God presence and love reality. And yet I've also got this heart and mind and body represented by like a warrior aspect of myself and a lover aspect of myself and a, a magician aspect of myself. And these are like different parts of myself and they create. There's all these different dynamics that happen between these dimensions of self. And so what if who I am is empowered, in power with God reality and that being steps in and shares power with all these parts of myself, and I bring all these parts of myself online. Now I'm co-creating as a whole being, not fighting these dimensions, like my heart hurts over here and my mind's thinking about something over here, but it's all unified, this community within self, and I'm co-creating as a, as a whole being. And now there's you, there's you and there's me, and there's all these others, and there's another opportunity to co-create, to create together. The actual co-creation from the laws of love is power with. So it's inviting others to create with me, empowering them so that they have power with to create whatever it is that we want to create together that's fueled and inspired by love.